You know, my friend, you would be surprised how many times I have had the question posed to me by a person really pondering what is going wrong in their career or their life, and they say, what is holding me back? What is my block? Well, usually it is something that is simpler than it seems on the surface. If you're confronting what seems to be an insurmountable challenge, you need to determine if something in your past is holding you back. Now, perhaps it is hurt feelings that are causing deep concern. What do we do with hurt feelings? We suppress them. We push them down, hoping they'll never come up, but they do come up, and they come up in silent ways that affect our lives in a very noisy way by blocking us and keeping us from moving ahead fully to realize our potential. Whatever the circumstances and whomever it involves, you can overcome every negative feeling or situation through forgiveness. Forgiveness. As a traveler on the path of truth, you pray as Jesus taught, saying, God, I forgive you, as I know you have forgiven me. So, in this moment of time, you forgive the you situations of your life. People, places, situations of the past. And you know what they are. If you really pray and meditate, they're not pushed down. They're still in their churning and they're holding on to you from keeping you from realizing everything that you desire to have in your life. Now, perhaps forgiving yourself is the highest thing that you need to do. It is often a greater challenge than forgiving others. If you think that you've acted unwisely in the past, you remind yourself that you are involved in an ongoing life, an ongoing learning experience, and a process to get better. And as you move forward, you release the chains of the past by releasing any lingering anger or resentment through forgiveness. Today, you release this and you move forward. And I pray that you are free from this moment on. As it says in Matthew 6, verse 14, If you forgive men their trespasses, your heavenly Father will also forgive you. Well, I've said in the past that forgiveness, a 2016 word for forgiveness, is release. You're not holding on any longer, you release. You're not holding on to the past anymore. You release. And what happens when you release? You spring forward without blocks to your new good. God bless you.